it, it's a fantastic show. I enjoy watching it all the time. And it's not because of anything you really talk about. It's because of the antics usually of Jeff O'Neill. What is yeah. it like with the three of you on a daily? It just seems like it's complete entertainment. Yeah, it is. Um, you know, our group texts are very interesting because it's like, you know, it, it, O-Dog's just a very funny guy. I, I don't know if you guys, I mean, you know him, but like if you, if you know him like intimately, he's a guy who's, he's really passionate, really caring. And, but he's just, he doesn't have that filter. So he'll just say or do something. And it's just, it's funny because um, as the years have gone on, I've gotten to know him. I certainly knew him as a player and we had crossed paths, but I, I never knew him personally. And he, he is what you see. He is like, he's, he's funny. Uh, he's passionate, but he, he's now he's self-deprecating. Like, you know, I don't know if you guys saw, he's racing Al's brother yeah. the other day, that board, like, oh yeah, it was incredible, but like, he's like, okay, guys, don't, don't make fun of my weight or don't make fun of this. But then he'll like put himself out there for everyone to make fun of. Him. And it's just, he's, I think he's incredible um, at, you know, creating content and we are all in the content game. And, and I think he does it organically. Like he doesn't like the one thing about our show. And I'm sure you guys are the same way now as you guys get rolling, like there's preparation, but a lot of it is just natural. Like, Hey, turn on the mics and let's talk and let's react. And, you know, the one thing we've learned over the years for the most part is you do it with respect. You can disagree with somebody, but don't make it personal. Um, O and I have had one bad fight early on in our, our broadcasting careers because we were both trying to win an argument instead of just focusing on what was, you know, the, the task at hand. And that was, you know, a, a topic. And since then, we've never had, we can disagree and O is good. He'll be like, you're an idiot or whatever, but it's, it's never personal. And I, I think that's what's helped us kind of like just grow and grow our audience is because we're three idiots that just we don't talk but then four o'clock we talk we turn the mics on and and people just happen to be listening and 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 watching and the only difference between us on air and off air is that we swear that's the only difference you know and i don't know if you guys are swearing on your podcast i haven't sworn but i just it's um you have to be mindful of that and Wally, you would know that for years. It's yeah. just hot, hot mics everywhere. You got to be aware of it. Well, we were always warned, like if you ever got caught swearing on a mic, you'd be fired. And so it's just ingrained in me not to say something like that. And so I, I completely understand the language part. Uh, it's a fantastic show. And I've never laughed so hard, except for the time that, or the time that you guys wore the, the shawl or he had the shoulder surgery. <laughs> um, that, that, that bit is outstanding. So I encourage people to go watch it.